So here's a short little update uh, on the 2018 Intense Carbine. I've been running it now for two years. Uh, a lot of the original components have since been replaced. Uh, I'm still running Halo Vortex um, 29 inch front and rear wheels with the Maxxis Minion DHR on the rear. I find that works nice. Cassette then, 11 speed cassette. Uh, it's a SRAM XG1150, which is a 10 to 42 tooth. That works okay. Shimano SLX rear derailleur. Runs fine. Uh, chain set then, crank set. Race face A effect R. So it's the slightly uh, sturdier version in 165mm length. DMR V12 pedals. The RockShox Deluxe shock is what came fitted with the bike, so that's original. The only thing, my only gripe with that, it does have rebound adjustment, but no compression. Dropper post brand X, scent 150mm length, no problems at all with that. Then moving on, WTB Silverado saddle. Rear disc is a 203mm Shimano XT with a Shimano XTR four piston rear caliper. Uh, cockpit, Renfall, bars cut to 780mm with reverse components, stem 35mm length, 35mm bars, then shifters, Shimano XT shifter with a Shimano XTR front brake, a little hack you can do uh, to fit uh, an XT to an XTR and really it just involves fitting I think a shorter bolt if I remember rightly and you have to just remove the hardware from inside where it actually mounts just down by there, uh, works fine. So same as the rear with a 203 mil Shimano XT rotor and front wheel again Halo Vortex 29 Maxis Maxis Shorty on the front great for uh, all year round really especially uh, winter Rockshock Shiari forks with 170 millimeters of travel so they as they've been for quite some time now and finally then I think the last piece is uh, probably one of the best upgrades I've done one of components uh, the action on it is I mean for something that you use so often I mean every time you use that it's a pleasurable experience finally then commensable alpha grips and that's about it